Hello, everyone. I welcome you to today's session of Sync Teaches AI, my YouTube channel. Uh, hope you are enjoying the learning. Uh, this time, I'll not be using much of the tools to make you understand things. I'm here just to talk about certain things. Uh, there's a confusion in uh, the freshers. They want to know what is the difference between generative AI and agentic AI. Agentic AI is very much in news. Uh, what's its use, the practical applications of both of these, and where do we use generative and agentic? When we talk about generative AI, this is everything that you do in chat GPT or Canva or any such tool where they generate based upon your prompts. You provide them instructions and they create a prompt based upon your instructions. That's generative AI. They're generating based upon your inputs. It could be images, texts, entire book, some uh, content. Or, so because that's it's creating content, that's, it's, that's why it's called creative AI. Generative AI is also the creative AI. On the other hand, when we talk about agentic AI, Agentic AI not only creates the content, it executes it on its own. It doesn't require human input at, in the entire process. Wherever it will require, it will notify you that here they would require, it would require your input. Otherwise it will go on. The four processes in Agentic AI is, first of all, it will provisionalize, then it will decide so once it's it it has perceived what is going to be done, then it will decide the way to go forward. Then it will execute and again, after execution, it will again learn from its outputs. So now after learning, it will again perceive. So perceive, decide, execute, learn, and so on. This is the loop that goes on in agentic AI. So here we are not providing any inputs, but it is generating on its own till it's stuck somewhere. So applications of generative AI, you know, you are creating content that's due to generative AI. Agentic AI, where you, you require, so first of all, the base of both of these, base of both of these are LLM or large language modules. What are these, how it's used? You can learn from scratch from a channel saying teaches AI. I have a playlist full of it. And yes, uh, this was a short story on comparison between agentic and generative AI. Agentic AI is the future. Companies are working on it. Generative AI, it is there. It will be there irrespective of agentic AI in the future. For more questions, you can reach me out. Details could be seen on my YouTube channel. For any questions or queries, most welcome till we see us again. Thank you.